The storage market in Greater Singapore has been static now for a couple of years. Um, we've had the addition of Jurong Port, which is probably the only new terminal that's, that's come into the fold here. Um, but what we've seen is a dropping away of some of the, uh, the projects that were hanging around for perhaps the last four or five years, um, which has calmed the market down. I think that's made a lot of sense to the existing operators in town. Um, what we're seeing in terms of the storage product market is a bit of a boost because of IMO 2020, which will give us an impetus of, uh, of storage activity well into 2020. Uh, and hopefully by the end of that period, we'll be looking at some form of uh, uh, reverse backwardation so, or, or, or contango that will give us some more activity into the region. Um, but basically, it's stable. I think we have a very stable market. We have hugely important and good facilities here. Um, and uh, I, I think we're on the good road really to sort of seeing stability and growth in the market going forward.